Hi and welcome to uh, the tutorial to install Google Windows Tester Pro along with um, your Eclipse development environment. Um, mostly I use this for uh, plugin development. So we'll get started on this tutorial on how to download uh, the correct uh, Eclipse development environment and install Google Windows Tester Pro with it. So first of all you can go to uh, www.eclipse.org forward slash indigo I think it is yeah and go to downloads in this section no okay it brings you back to the normal size maybe here yeah and then you can uh, download the Eclipse ID for Java EE developers um, I already have this downloaded so I don't need to download it um, it may take a while um, I recommend the 32-bit distribution just to start with and there you go it's downloading there um, while uh, actually I'm gonna let it just download this and uh, install it from scratch so I'm just going to get rid of this directory here so that make it more consistent for the tutorial um, that's going to download pretty quickly there anyways so uh, maybe open up another tab in your Google Chrome or Firefox and you want to go to this URL right here that I'm highlighting and we're gonna use this uh, URL here that I'm highlighting for Indigo and install the Google Windows Tester um, Pro Toolkit from the update site so that's downloaded there I'm gonna extract this to um, I'm gonna extract this to my user in Windows and I'm going to call it Eclipse dash uh, indigo and let that extract to there it's going to take a couple of moments that's great and now um, also you you will have to have a, a Java development kit installed and I have other tutorials already if you look on my um, YouTube page and you should be able to install them but uh, let's get back to this tutorial anyways so what we want to do is start up Eclipse And I'm just going to make one call indigo dash wt for Windows Tester. You can call the workspace whatever you want. I'm just doing this for the purpose of the tutorial. Okay, so we want to close down the welcome page and now we want to go to help and install new software and we want to grab that URL link for the update site and copy that in there go add Call that WT dash indigo three dot seven. Okay. So that's uh, found everything that we need. Uh, click everything. 
with the runtime and the launcher requirements and the libraries for using Windows Tester. You want everything there, so just go ahead and click next. And next, uh, accept the terms, click finish. It seems to be taking a little bit longer than it usually does. And there it goes, it started off. We can click OK to that. I doubt Google have anything malicious in there. And we can restart now. Um, if you want to check that installed, we can go to help about Eclipse. And we can go installation details, sorry. And there we can see installed software. You have the core runtime and everything else for. Uh, launching uh, JUnit test is what you're going to be uh, developing. Okay, thanks very much for watching this tutorial and in the next one I'm going to show you how to set up a, a plugin application and uh, run the recorder to generate the base JUnit test class and play it back.